Wewe ni mchungaji. Leo umeamua kujiunga na praise and worship. Unasikia <laughs> Stima imeenda. <laughs> hey. Damn. Man. <laughs> Hi. Are you ready to know what you don't know about small changes? Well, you are in the right place. This is the Academy of Small Changes podcast, bringing you small changes that lead to huge progress. And for your information, even your stations are tuned in too. Yeah. <laughs> now, he is your host, Eliud Achero. One of the greatest challenges this world is facing is we have people who know enough about their jobs to think they are right, but not enough about their jobs to know they are wrong. When you are looking for a job, there are certain traits that are usually not listed in the JD, job description. The most common traits you usually find are must have good communication skills gani ingine must be a team player must be a team player must be able to multitask that is what we usually find but where do you find wisdom as a character trait in your JD where do you find humanity as a character trait in your JD. I'm going to share with you five jobs that if you can't think on your feet, if you can't apply wisdom on your feet, if you can't apply humanity on your feet, stay away. Stay away and redirect your energy to the right jobs and become a very productive member of this society. What are some of these um, jobs that these people should consider joining? Military, soldiers, yeah. scaries, you fight for Barabara. this country. This country needs people like you. You also need to become a superpower. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And don't get me wrong. I haven't said that these jobs are bad. What I'm simply saying is these jobs are are attracting unnecessary curses. That's why for your survival, for your family's survival, for your generational survival, you need that extra bit of trade that is not included in the JD. Why should you attract curses in your line of duty for doing your job? Because these curses can stretch out to your family and even generation. Do you know that when it comes to jobs, you are totally replaceable? You are not replaceable at home. So why risk your family's and generational well-being for a replaceable job? It's a damn good show. Yeah. yeah. It's Madara is in the building. Yo, yo, yo. It's gonna help me examine these jobs. Mm-hmm. Number one on the list. Debt collection agents. Especially those who come and collect your property after a missed loan payment. We are not refusing. We have people who don't like paying the bills. But if you were to do what I think the job doesn't require you to do, something like asking them why they missed their loan payment, you'll start asking yourself, Kama inge kwa mimi, inge du? It's Madara. Have you met? Ama, have you ever heard about this... um, debt collection agents shai patana nao ana kwa ana am shai wasikia tu sijui patana nao ana kwa ana but 
Nini ya zasema? Mm. Atujakata, it's, mm. your, it's your job mm. unafanya, si ndio? Mm-hmm. Yes, naelewa ni for, for, for survival, sir. Mm-hmm. But ukienda kupatana na mse. Ati hiyo yao si, si for survival. Hiyo yao ni to earn a living. Eh, kitu kama hiyo. But sasa, was in wendo upatane wendo mpata mse amekufa alikuwa na loan si ndio ameiacha mecheki mhm wewe ende upate ni madhe ameacha ameacha madhe watu hii si ndio mhm wewe kam juni ju job yako unafanya uchukue property labda hata hiyo shambo umechukua au hiyo hiyo property umechukua mm-hmm. ni 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 ya uh, ancestor eh manze ni ancestors ni, ni, ni generation yake mm. cheki mm-hmm. anaipitisha tu ancestral land eh wewe chukue manze alafu umeacha au atui hapo hajui venye utaanza hajui pale wanaenda mm-hmm. unaona mm-hmm. unaweza kwenda tu hapo kama kama ni wewe mm. unaenda kufanya hiyo job enda 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 ongalie situation kwanza wako mm. kama ni yes ni kitu kama wako rich enda enda waambie hivi na hivi mm. unaona mm. go step by step manze mm-hmm. wenda ka nao chini mm-hmm. waambie hivi na hivi bwana yako aliacha aliacha loan mm-hmm. na hajaliba mm-hmm. unaona mm-hmm. so ni, ni heri kuliko kwenda tu chukuange kila kitu mm. waache watu haji pale wataanza unaona imagine I vitu mean, zimechange sai mm. wewe kama debt collection agent vile tu it's madara anasema kazi ni ku collect property umekuja ku collect property tuseme tu hiyo ancestral land We unataka kuniambia our ancestors wote ungane waungane <laughs> wajiite kamkutano kamkunji kaanze kakuu eh hey. <laughs> unataka kuniambia utapatana nao usiku wewe unataka kuniambia hawatakuwa my friend these are the jobs that once you lack something that we called wisdom and humanity stay away number two, power agents mabazu watu wa kukata stima we are not refusing We have people who don't like paying the bills. But if you want to do what I think the job doesn't require you to do. Mm-hmm. Something like asking them why someone failed to pay in time. Yeah, you'll have a second thought. Okay. Okay. When imfanya biashara wa kinyozi. Umechelewa kulipa stima. Unasikia tuf. Stima imeenda. Ndio job kale kama machine kana kujanga. Kwanza huko kama machine stima ikianda unajua inakushikanga kanyole hapo. Eh, mavinyozi wenyewe wanapenda tu waanze tu na katikati vizuri. Eh. Baada waanze na kando at least unajua ukikaa kama unyelewa style. Kwanza ile period ya back to school. Umeanza tu kunywa hapo katikati Jordan. Ai bwana. Umechelewa kulipa stima unasikia tuf. Unajua huwezi kunywa na gilete. Stima imeenda. Ai ai ai. unapoteza customer. Unapoteza biashara. Wewe ni msanii. Una record album yako ya kwanza. Unasikia tuf. Stima imeenda. Ai bwana. Kwanza kwanza mimi niambie sasa umeekewa hapo. Alafu sasa unajua ikiekwa eh ile hizo unakuwa una na headphone mm-hmm. unajisikia kinyu unasema una, unasikia kinyu unarecord unajua hapa hauna auto tune oi bana unajua ina ina ile sauti yako original manze unajua sasa unakuwa na confidence unaimba hiyo kitu si ndio mm afu imu niambie zimwe tu unasikia confidence yako inashukanga mbio mbio juu unasikia hiyo sauti Yes, so Tiago da Semanga Z. Nani Ana, album zi. yako ya kwanza una release. <laughs> Umelipa producer. Alafu <laughs> kwanza ukue na was, na kimbogi kia kuchachisha. Na unataka hiyo ngoma mbogi imekuchocha hii ngoma inafikia Calligraph Jones. Wazi alafu eh. kwa album yako ya kwanza. Unasikia 
Bana hapo akwambia ina, inashuka kabisa manzo na kuanga za zi. Hapana. Yeah. Zi. Yeah, Hadi nimeacha kuimba. Wewe ni mchungaji. Leo umeamua kujiunga na praise and worship. Unasikia <laughs> Stima imeenda. <laughs> Hey, damn, man, damn. Bro, boy, na me anza kushuka. Lakini ya se ucha chisha sa zingi. Jumanze, yes, unajua Mike zikipote ya. Tunasikia yes, imefanya yo. Sinyo, but. Kuna kuna venye ofa ikutatisho na ofa kuendelea tu kuimba. Wakati wanze kutuambia ti roho bwana sasa ndo ameanza kushuka. Hey. Kile kote imepotea mjalipa. Kwanza unajua vile za kanisa zinakwanga hizi expensive machines, speakers. Maya, ma initonga Yohama. So Yohama. Eh, Yahama Yamaha. Eh na mapayonia. Payonia. We zile zenye zinakwanga na 3D automated. Present worship mse wa keyboard amezikwenda wa guitar amezikwenda present worship unasikia stima imeenda na kwa sasa roho bwana ameanza kushuka na hakuna kitu kama hiyo ni watu zipote wewe ni mfanya biashara wa PS uko na mavijana hapo jamaa anacheza Chelsea versus Arsenal Chelsea anaenda kufunga bao unasikia Stima imeenda na mmebet hiyo game. Eh mwanza alafu unajua pale mtu anaweza anaweza kuvunja tu ile TV mwanza wa Hey. TV yako iende. Ivunjwe. Au na biashara hiyo siku mwanza unaweza kuwa tu. TV imeharibika. Mm. Najua sasa hii stima anayo sijalipa. Eh. Wamenikatia stima. Je mwanza anaweza kuambia mwanza? Anaweza kukujia mwanza. Hey. Wakukuja wakwambie bro hadi wewe chill bana. Ai. Hey. Unajua au atakata stima. Tunaelewa ni kazi. Sawa ni kazi yako lakini uchill manze. Ujui hata asikuchill. Unajua awaji wanakatia nani stima. Unaweza katia mchawi stima. Wewe kiripoko jini mvitu. Can you predict the outcome? Hey, Ebu jaribu predict katia mchawi stima. Predict the outcome litakuwa. Eh hey, manze tunaenda tu kiripoko vitu zao kwa barabara ukiona wewe utadu. Utadu. <laughs> utandio kwa hapo ukatie stima mse yako na mbogi genji eh hey, bana unafuatwa ama saa zingine unajua kuna wasi wengine ni mauru sana hey, na unajua hiyo meter box na kwanga metal casing jamaa amefanya tu hapo direct connection ya stima unakuja unakuja kudisconnect stima nasikia unakaukia hapo Wakuja wakupata hapo wakumwagia tu maji uendelee kuchavo kuchavo kuchavo. <laughs> Imagine kwa kazi tu ambayo oh. unafanya. Jumanze. Kazi. Jumanze kuna day. Baridi imejapa. Ingo. Mm. Eh, nikasema eh, ilikuwa post juu ma 3. Mm. Nikasema ah acha basi niende nikaoge. Ji baridi vingi vingia. Mm. Ah. Kafungudia sha. Eh, hot shower. Afu na je siku mother alikuwa ameniambia aje eh msifungulie watu wa stima hatujali eh na je so mimi nilikuwa huko chini mimi nimeenda ni mmoja nzuri ndio unajua watu hao watu wanakwanga dangerous wako na kiatu kingine hapo inakanga hook wanapanda kwa pole eh sasa mimi naoga nasikia ufu hapo nimechunisha nimechunisha unajua unajua kioga sasa zingine na ngoma inakuanga fit eh afu nasikia eh afu unadhalia ni kama ni shawi imeharibika na ni hufa ni stima imepot imekatwa eh alafu sasa kama maji kana kupata sasa kale kabarini unajua ina ina ngifanya hiyo sauti inaacha tu unajua unajua bado ushawa pia kiki sema stima zipote mm. kuna kuna hiyo naweza kutoa spark au itoe hiyo kelele mm. manzi wewe kusema usipige shock bana unaweza kukutapa eh manzi kazi zingine hapana we that's why we saying kama huna wisdom and humanity stay away 
Number three, water supply agents. Watu wakukata maji. Especially in dry spell counties like Turkana, Marsabit, na Kajiado. Kajiado. Mbaya, mbaya. Kwa zi za za kiseria. Kiangazi.com. Mi nko shuo kwa ata ata kinyesha, hiyo juwa badi na wakanga. Wee. Jumanze, no juu mm. ndo masaidi za kuenda magadi. Eh. Hey. Eh hey, bana. Um, na kwambia ni mwai kuenda de flani. Mm. Mwenda tu kama kitrip. Mm. Mbeba chakula, baridi. Mm. Afia, ni kazi ye kazi kwe. Donge ile ice kabisa. Mm-hmm. Kutoka kwa nyumba vizuri. Mm-hmm. Jesu nakakunye wa pole pole. Liyacha kitu kama 10 minutes tu hivi inachemka nika imetoka kwa microwave nika imetoka kwa microwave what imechemshwa ai bana hadi unasema nikikunywa hii sasa nafanya nini yenyewe mm. hadi inabidi uombe wale watu tunye sasa kuna tule to rich kids mm. tumekaa kama tumewekewa hapa hali yenye itakuwa tu baridi tu eh eh na tukatai na tutakunyima tu atukatai ai bana we are not Kusia refusing bana. we have people who don't like paying the bills oh na sahau But we are urging you to think about it. Imagine in these counties eh, kuna mababu, kuna manyanya ambao wanaishi peke yao. Wazeze. Waze waze eh? yeah. Wale wenye wana, wana struggle. Eh, you understand? Ile eh, ile age. Eh, imagine ukatie mse kama huyo. Especially in these dry counties. Akona chakula lakini haezi pika jo hakuna maji hakuna maji akona basin but haezi yoga jo hakuna maji akona kikombe but haezi kunywa maji jo hakuna maji na ujue sasa hata kama anaishi na na, na msee mm huo msee bado akienda kutafuta maji mm na cheki mm. ni distance bado distance na do bado inahitajika ukienda kupata msee akona akona boho distance atakwambia anadai afu kurudi na bidhi huko kuna na kwanga na boho kweli hizo mabezi labda but ni mbali mbali eh ni mbali mbali na ni mbali mbali imagine wewe unataka kuniambia babu kama huyu nyanya kama huyu akiamua kukutamkia maneno ya laana unataka kuniambia itakupata itakupata mbaya itakushika mashati mbaya ikuvuruge mbaya stay away number four. kazi ya ukanjo mabazu wengine and we are still insisting we are not refusing that we have people who are very much talented in breaking the law yeah but you see we have a few very innocent people juzi nimekuwa tao Sunajua hapo hapo eh, around ambassador uki extend to hapo hivyo mpaka ngara huko kuna kwanga na wasee wanaozanga to mask hivi to fruit unapata to madhie tumeka chini tunauza tumachungwa to veggies wamekata kata unaona na to mask hapo hivyo yeah. so kulikuwa na kulikuwa tuna line fulani unajua vile anga wanachipanga kuna in that mid is but most walikuwa ma vijana vijana na wasi wengine wako hapo mid 20s mid 30s kuna madhe fulani hivi alikuwa na mtu hii age na ka around between 40 and 50 alikuwa na mtu hii mm. na hawa sisi sijui sijui wanajuangaje kanjoa na kama nakwambia in 3 seconds nasikia shafunga virago ameenda nasikia shu, shu, shu. kila mse asha pack vitu zake ameka kwa mgongo ameo ameo kuomoka ame mwanjoka au something sheng ni tricky but mnielewe <laughs> yani wamepack vitu zao wameenda wame left wame left but kitu ilini 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 strike ni huyu madhe akwa na mtu hii unaangalia age yake anauza machungwa hapo hivyo na tu masks mm. machungwa ina kwanga how much ndivi kuseme tu bei yake ya kununua hiyo machungwa ni ngovu 5 bob yakienda kuuza ni kiende yani 0.05 US dollars si ndio kaa hesabu yangu ijakuwa mbaya eh hapo hapo 
profit yake ni 5 bob in fact you ata see profit hiyo pesa i am sure ni yake ya survival yani tu a survive na ako na mtu hii sio mtoto imagine ame, ame sacrifice alishe tu mtu hii ya kule yeye atapata imagine huyu madhe alikuwa anajaribu kusimama yani na ile haraka yao sasa wengine wameenda yeye ako tu hapo na struggle unajua hiyo hiyo uzito love you age yake ana struggle tu ana bounce back una get mm. hebu picture hiyo ana bounce tu back mm. ana jaribu kusimama kanjoa na kam imagine kanjo alimpata au zingine wamepiga kona hadi miss kwa check <laughs> imagine huyo madhe alianza kulia mm. na kanjo bado ana mtu anishambio ana mtu anishambio unaona jo ana kwanga na kiboko fulani hivi kia black eh. wengine wabebangi but wengine ni mwacheki wako na Imagine anatoanisha hiyo madhe machungo imemwagika imeenda kwa baro na unajua hapo kuna manganya zinapita mbio mbio is a is is a manganya so unajua manganya vile zina na ni nzito na bonda tu machungu zake huyo madhe alikuwa analia unataka kuniambia wewe kama kanjo kilio cha huyu mama mm. unataka kuniambia hakuna lano it, utapata hapo iko iko itakushika mashati mbaya that's why we are saying hizi kazi tunaelewa ni kazi lakini if you can't think on your feet if you can't apply wisdom on your feet if you can't apply humanity on your feet hebu mm. evaluate situation yako una encounter nayo kama huwezi apply all these things we are talking about yeah stay away number 5 landlord especially kwanza middle class kwenda chini imagine wewe ni student wewe umetoka mashambani umekuja Nairobi kutafuta masomo wewe ni wewe kwenu wewe ni wa kwanza kwenda university umekuja hii Nairobi kutafuta masomo alafu umeshika ka keje hivi ka 6000 hivi fee tena ni wewe mwenyewe unajilipia sema fee around 40000 wewe mwenyewe una hustle ulipe hivi imagine landlord akufungie mlango kwa sababu umechelewa kulipa rent hatukatai rent wange nalipo at the end of every month but take a look at this you ni student no na job le university kuna kwanga mm. the moment you fail to pay your fee in time We na examine our approach no, it's either you redo uh, repeat nini u repeat your semester ama hata shule zingine u repeat your mwaka mm. unataka kuniambia upatie tu you student hiyo pressure yani aamue i hustle yake ame hustle aike tu kwa rent asilale nje na unajua hii Nairobi vile na kwanga sit down it's a very dangerous wana semanga ni nairobari <laughs> eh? yeah. imagine ufungie huyu huyu student mlango yani akose kufanya mtihani ama akose kulipa fee unajua sasa zingine tunaelewa we, we understand this situation on a, on a landlord's perspective mbona msikwe na a conversation kama watu wazima either alipe rent mara mbili in the coming month aweka interest ama aweka interest hapo juu unaona hiyo mm. at least mtakuwa mutually you are benefiting because yeah. number one, wewe kama landlord hautaki kupoteza client na yenyewe wewe kama student hautaki kukosa nyumba because number one, wewe uliingia kwa hiyo keje ukiwa na hapa mimi naweza survive wacha niishi Mm, no, no, adi, uki, uki mfungia, mm. akitoka hapo mm. obviously ni bad review umepatiwa kama Ma. landlord unacheki kwa landlord ambaye other students ama other clients wata refer mtu that's why we are saying kama huwezi apply wisdom kama huwezi apply humanity mm. stay away from these five jobs Mm-hmm. You never know what someone is going through. Everybody is fighting silent battles. Mm. 
some people in this country are living in invisible prisons yani wako na mashida tu lakini hawezi kutangazia hawezi kuambia kwa nini imechelewa kulipa kitu fulani invisible yeah. prisons yani mtu tu ako na mashida zake lakini amejiwekea because akiamua kukuambia utakuwa like sasa unaniambia nikusaidieaje life is so hard already things are not always as they appear huu unaona mtu tu amechelewa kulipa but if you take that initiative to dig deep you will understand why amechelewa kulipa vitu zingine si intentional na tukatai kuna watu wenye wapendi kulipa that one atukatai but kuna special circumstances that you need to think on your feet if you lack these qualities you are talking about wisdom and humanity please there is no need for you to attract unnecessary curses for doing your job right yani wewe ni mtu wa kukata stima umekata stima vizuri wallahi wewe ni mtu wa kukata maji umekata maji vizuri hakuna hata yenye leak hakuna to drop sawa hadi na kohoa hadi hakuna moyo kusiki nafungua hivi nafungua tab hivi nafanya eh yani asubuhi wenye una mkanga usiwe kohe eh sasa hiyo ndo tab ina kuonyesha pia eh wewe ni debt collection agent Mm-hmm. Yaani ume collect property vizuri vile tu kazi na ku require ufanye. Mm. Wewe ni landlord umefungia mtu vizuri in fact na special padlock. Enye ukiamua ku break it down lazima utafute kitu inaitwa ngaje hii wasewa metal crowbar. Inaitwa crowbar. Hii yeah. ya kukata inatoanga sparks hizi. Whatever the name is Yaani ume, umefanya Pawaso. kazi yako ume, eh ume, ni Pawaso. Pawaso ni ya miti bro. <laughs> <laughs> yaani umefanya kazi yako Sina vizuri kaya, sana. Hmm? Mbona ujitafutie tu kas ambayo potentially inaweza kufikia wewe, inaweza kufikia familia yako ama generation yako? Hmm? Why does it have to go to that point? That's why we are saying the greatest challenge this world is facing is we have people who know enough about their jobs to think they are right but not enough about their jobs to know they are wrong think about it think about it because i believe kama we ni mse uko na energy kama hii you need to redirect this energy to the right jobs ikiwezekana join the army ikiwezekana join the military ikiwezekana kwa director kwa <laughs> director ama ingia Kenya Defense Force ingen NYS NYS hmm? people like you need to fight for this country not fighting the vulnerable Nonze. imagine kuweka energy kama hiyo kwa, kwa babu kwa nyanya kwa mshosho yani Sio people wakini. who are just trying to survive surely we unataka kuniambia na hii nguvu yote unajua ni kama kutafuta alana na nguvu yani unangangana tu unaangalia una vile high school uh, waseus kramia canteen yani unangangana tu na hiyo energy <laughs> na ngana tuna hiyo energy unatafuta laana please if you lack wisdom mm-hmm. and humanity mm-hmm. come always think on your feet and apply all these things you are talking about mm-hmm. stay away when there is cash on the line you can do very irrational jobs tunaelewa saa zingine unaweza tafuta kazi ukose umesomea kitu fulani umeapply umeapply how wit Mm. but ili inapatikana ni these five jobs that we are talking about atusemi ni mbaya lakini ukwe na utu ukwe na utu ukwe na hekima uweze kufikiria kwa hiyo situation think on your feet 
because when there is cash on the line we touch kwa hiyo job because you also want to earn a living of which we understand so true you need to But think how? about it you need to think about it life is so hard already people are living in invisible prisons tuache kuweka maisha ikae ngumu sana as it to to yake to fair ikuwe fair so unfair bana mm ama another alternative mimi naona unaangalia hizi story za kukata stima kukata maji we understand kuna watu wachelewa so that to see categorize wale innocent na na wale criminals pamoja tunaweza move digitally let's move digital eh let's move uh, digitally yeah yeah kama ni kukata stima wacha ikuwe ni system inakata isikuwe ni wewe au maji ni system ikuwe ni system to unajua say we are living in what century 21st century eh say we've developed technologically acha mm. ikuwe ni system inakata isikuwe ni wewe unapata lana ya bure brother kwa nini kwa kufanya tu kazi let's think on our feet please if you are lacking these qualities you are talking about stay away